That's right, I am going to be teaching you how to set up the Elgato using the PC or Mac using the PS4, right? It's pretty simple to do, all right? Or Xbox, doesn't really matter. It's all the same, all right? But anyways, it's 2019, which is an updated video, all right? And even though it's not November 2018, let me know down in the comments if you uh, survived by leaving a like. But anyways, how to set this up, the Elgato, all right? So I'm pretty sure you already opened it up because you were so excited. It came with the HDMI cable, the power cable, and the uh, Elgato itself right here, right? Not that complicated, all right? So how to plug it in and how to set it up is pretty simple using OBS or the software provided with the uh, Elgato itself. If you're using a Mac, I will do right now. Do not use OBS. It is horrible, right? No Mac is supported with OBS. You can stream, but the quality is garbage and it is straight trash. Oh! Use the software that's provided in here if you're using Mac. If you're using PC, your luck you can use OBS nice and smoothly, right? Yeah, yeah. right? But anyways, let's get started. All right, I forgot to mention in the video, I didn't even say it, but uh, before you plug in anything into the Elgato PS4 or the PC, you first want to uh, go to your settings and go all the way down here, right? So go all the way down and click system, all right? So once you have system, you want to make sure the enable HT no, 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 no. HDCP is not checked, all right? <laughs> so make sure it's unchecked. That's about it. All right, so once you unpackage the Elgato, it will show, there you go, HD60S. You will see a uh, out output right there, but it will show. Uh, I'm gonna do one of those makeup girls right there. They be doing this all the time. Out and in, all right? So which one the HDMI goes to mm -hmm. is pretty simple, all right? So remember by this, the HD60 logo, that's where you put the cable at. Wrong, stupid. That came inside the box, all right? So plug this, uh, the HDMI cable that came inside the box inside here. Okay, so I'm stupid. I messed up here. Don't connect it to that side. Connect it to the other side. Sorry for interrupting your beautiful video here, but uh, yeah, just connect it to the other side, not that side, all right? Okay, let's just, I guess, continue. And then put the power cable that came inside the box too. And the other side, which goes right here, not the HDMI port, but that smaller one right there, obviously it will fit perfectly. This end of the USB goes into your PC, Mac, whatever you're using. And this side right here goes into your PS4, right? And uh, you're probably saying, I don't have a second HDMI cable to go on the other side. Well, use the one you already have that's plugged in already into your PS4. Just unplug the one they're using already to your PS4 like this. Ignore the mess, it's a mess, I know. But as you can see here, here's the HDMI that's already connected to my PS4. Disconnect that and that's all you have to do and just leave that out. The second step is, is wipe out the Elgato and just uh, you know set it up anywhere you want. And you wanna connect this side of the HDMI, like I said, to the PS4, right? So connect this side to the PS4, right? So coming for the uh, Elgato, right? So go ahead and just do that. There you go, it's in, all right? And this side, which you unplugged from the PS4, goes to this side of the Elgato. All right, sorry for interrupting your video again, but uh, just plug it into the other side. Just no problem, all right? Just pretend that cord wasn't there. Just plug it in to the whole different side, all right? And there you go, it's all set up, all right? And the second step is, is get the power code right here, like I said, and connect it to your computer. And of course, I have the MacBook, so I had to get the uh, adapter to it, which is BS. Know your fucking place, trash. But you have a PC, you shouldn't have this issue. Um, Fuck! There you go, it's connected. As you can see, it turned on, and that's a good sign, all right? And all you have to do is just open up the uh, PC, obviously. And there, I know it's a kind of a mess, but yeah, here it is. Nothing uh, too crazy. All right, so once you have everything connected, check the description down below and download the Elgato software game capture app from the uh, website, of course. It's official, it's not virus or nothing. It's completely harmless, all right? Uh, click this little icon there. You wanna go to capture, and then you wanna click PlayStation 4. Just make sure everything's set up to the way you want it. So if you're recording or live streaming, you wanna make sure it's compatible with your system. Click OK, and then there you go. Click record, and that's how to set it up, all right? That simple. <laughs> If you're using PC, you might as well, uh, I'm pretty sure you're going to be using OBS, all right? I do not recommend it for Mac. It is trash, horrible, all right? So I already have it all set up for me. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and just set up a new session for y'all guys, all right? So click add, 
and then you want to name it whatever you want I'm gonna name it video Elgato because I can remember that's it anyways it should look pitch black don't worry you're not being hacked all right just yet all right but anyways under sources there should be a plus button click that right there and then you want to click video capture device all right click that right there and then you want to name it Elgato because that's the Elgato footage name that right there and then under devices and it should pop up the Elgato like I said it doesn't work for Mac so it doesn't pop up for me but if you were using the PC it should be there just pretend that was the uh, Elgato which obviously it isn't just click OK simple as that and this should be the gameplay you can stretch it out with the uh, little red dots right there see there you go stretch it out or you can just like play around with it you know and to go live streaming just click settings and um stream and then uh, i already made a whole separate video on how to uh, set up the twitch or youtube uh i'll leave it down to the card right there that's for twitch right there i'll wait for like five seconds for you to click on that and how to stream from twitch to obs and here's how to stream from youtube there's a little bit longer video because it shows you how to set up all of obs and all of the uh streaming with youtube all right but anyways hope you guys did like this video and i hope you guys helped you and how to stream let me know in the comments if you're having any problems with audio like i said here's the other card and how to fix the audio because or this side i don't know what side i was pointing at but just check out the video because you will run into audio issues trust me i ran into it and i stressed for five hours and i fixed it and just check out that video i will save you a lot of time please leave a like subscribe i have a lot of content like this right and uh, check out my second channel please subscribe to my second channel please 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 Anyways, I'll see you guys Fortnite School Troopers later. Peace.